There are so many tearlets around here. Oh, where's my cursor? Hmm, Windows tier list. Oh, it took it took like 14 minutes or something like that. Oh, this is pretty short. Episode 46. It's so every Windows version ever. The worst version of Windows. Antivirus tier list. There are lots of Windows tier lists. I'm gonna make one too. I have tier maker open in a Chrome tab. And I will write here uh, win mm. Oh I'm like an hunter pack type. Never mind. Oh Windows versions. There's an option for Windows versions. Let's click on this. We have six tiers. S, 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 A, B, C, D, and F. We have those versions of Windows. Windows 95, 98, 2000, Windows 1.0, Windows... What is it? Oh, sorry. This is Windows 2.0, Windows 98, Windows 7, Windows Me. NT, Windows 10, Windows Vista, Windows 8.1, Windows 11, and Windows 7. Oh, Windows XP, sorry, sorry. This might seem like Windows 10. It's normally Windows 8, but we will consider it Windows 11 because I really want to, to include it because it's my main computer. I didn't have virtual machines. I only had virtual machine for Windows 11. So I will, I will start off with um, Windows 95. I'm not gonna include Windows 2.0 because because I forgot. So sorry, 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 sorry. This. Oh, this. Let's click on this. Oh, we can run this, huh? This. Oh. I really don't know what I am doing. Launching emulator. Oh. Oh! Microsoft Internet Explorer. Whoa, that's great. I love this sound. I love this startup sound. I don't care about the time. Okay. Oh, perfect. This was a great operating system. It had this famous new taskbar. Oh, where's my cursor? Oh, there was shut down options. Run. Help. Oh, it was good. Settings, documents. Oh, it has some menus. And menus. It had both. Which was pretty good. You know, Windows Explorer. Let's look at my computer. 
I don't know what I'm doing these days. Uh, finally, it took a very long time. Oh, this is so slow. I didn't think that this operating system is that much slow. This might be, be a simulator thing, but it's just, it's just, I can't believe that this is the normal Windows 95. So, we will consider this Windows 3.11 and Windows 98 the same. Or we can just look for an uh, emulator for Windows 3.11 later. So, I'm gonna go... I should give this one a B. B. What? Well, now, let's think, get things a little bit more snappy. Windows tree simulator. This oh oh, what is this? What's the sound that came out? Oh my gosh. Finally open, but it took just a couple of seconds, so I don't know why I cut it. So number one. Oh. Task list. We can cancel right away. It has a task list. That's pretty cool. It's also known as task manager today. Oh, visual basic. Oh, they introduced a control panel. Control panel. This is, you know, managing settings and stuff. But I don't know. Color, fonts. Sound, date and time. It was... It was... It was great. Oh, how can I... How can I close this out? Oh, I... Now I closed it out. Um, Windows setup. We can set up Windows, I think. Um... I'm gonna go place escape. Oh, I need to to find my cursor. Oh, this is good, but I'm gonna put this on B too. It wasn't that big of a surprise. Or. We can put those both on A because I saw the SS tier now. Sorry, so sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Now we are going to Windows 2000. Oh, Windows 2000. This was a great operating system. This looks like this because of the emulator thing because I have too much. Windows side to side, and I don't have Windows Explorer running. Start. Oh, start menu is similar to in Night Five and Night Five. Oh, there was some menus. For example, you could customize taskbar and start menu. Oh, oh. I'm not gonna show it. Oh, you know, Internet Explorer.
Oh, Internet Explorer. That's pretty cool. How I can quit from Internet Explorer? Um, never mind. I'm gonna go. I thought I'm giving this one a B. Just because it ha had a Microsoft Internet Explorer, but it had. It was so overkill. It was an overkill operating system for computer beginners. Now Windows 1.0. Is it this? Let's. Let's start DOS box like we did in Windows 95. Oh. Oh. How I can get into it? Oh. There was write.exe, which was basically, you know, WordPad. It had a control panel, command prompt, but I can't, I can't multitask. I can't multitask. This is the taskbar, but I, I can't imagine multitasking and doesn't show this current which is pretty confusing um, clock there okay okay that's great calculator calendar but I will give this a C or B B is better for this kind of operating system just because in ms dos like you need to all these commands and it was so a lot more confusing so never mind now we should go to 98 where's 98 oh i love this operating system and i love the site too because it's pretty cool to to be back on it it was pretty fast it ha had amazing driver support no, 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 no. It was still built on DOS, which is pretty cool. Windows 2000 was built on Windows NT. Um, yes, we will go to Windows NT. But it has a new technology. The C drive. Mm, the computer equivalent view. is similar to Windows 11, which we get today. But it is... It is so, man, it's so cool. It has thumbnails, which it says, oh, oh, wait a minute. Nothing, nothing. Don't, no fear. Oh, it's so good. So cool. Calculator. There are system files too. Oh, this is a great operating system. Internet Explorer. Launching this takes a while, but this might be this emulator thing. Oh, it's so cool. It's so cool. For example, Oh, I didn't know that it can still search now. This is the 1998 Google, which is pretty good. Moving on, Notepad. Oh, Notepad. I love it. It's pretty much like Windows 10. It isn't like Windows 11, which is, has better Notepad. It has tabs, and we will come back to that one. Um, I will give, I'm not going to put SS because it's like super amazing, the most popular operating system, but let's keep exploring. Oh, Minesweeper, I love Minesweeper. Oh man, I'm, 
I'm I'm busted. What am I? This is getting S tier. And now we have Windows 7 XP. Oh yes, 7, 7. Let's go. Oh. The simulator is a bit clickbait. We need to log on. Oh, the startup sound is great. Computer. This is a little bit more modern. It has... No, oh, what's this? What's this? This might be a virtual machine thing, so I don't care. Oh. I didn't expect that much from one virtual machine. But, never mind. Oh. Good, good, good. Good to go. Oh, it has very good sounds and I, oh, oh, I need to reload it. I need to wait all. Oh, I love this. I love this visual. Let's enter again. That beautiful sound again. Oh. It's a power plan. Oh, power saver. Oh. Start menu has. Like Chrome Cross and such. What does that mean? I know. Because normally Windows 7 doesn't have Chrome. Oh, the command prompt. Let's see how. Let's try to help too much. Oh. This is great. I can just write a uh, logo and I can finally shut off from this operating system. Oh, this is a pretty good operating system. I'm gonna put it. To SST. It is super glorious. Let's go to Windows Me. Where's my Windows Me? Oh, oh. People, people say this, this it had a lot of bugs and it is even worse to Microsoft products. Well, we will see. Oh. This is good. It's the rebrand of Windows 98 or 2000. Oh, there is Optic Express. But this operating system was pretty unpopular. And you really can't close Windows without the, the Alt F4. This might be a virtual machine thing, but I don't really understand. Launch was pretty bad, so I'm gonna put I'm gonna put Windows Me to D. Now it's time for Windows NT. We're using Windows NT 4.0. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, I forgot to run it. Oh, I need to go to my history. Oh, history. There I go. Um, I do my best to find the Windows NT. I will close this out and we are using Windows NT 4.0 which we use with virtual desktop.org just like we use Windows 2000 and me. This is also a great site but let's look at the this thing because we are not doing anything with the emulator we are just doing with the simulation. That's what it Oh, it has a network network but I don't know why 
This doesn't work. Oh, oh, oh. My computer. Oh. It supported floppy drives too. Yeah, Windows 11 supports floppy drives too. And I think Windows NT, I don't know how to rank this. It is just a rebrand. Oh, oh. It is just a rebrand. It is just a rebrand! Wait, wait. Oh, okay. I don't know how to rank this operating system. If I rank this wrong, so sorry. Sorry about that. Don't... Don't say anything bad in the comments and respect me. Mm. Police, police, because it is my fault. I, my mind can't think how to rank this. Try to my mind's part. It wasn't a big of a surprise. So, it's gonna go B, B. Just because it wasn't that big of a surprise. But there are still operating systems that are built on NT. And I can put them on SS, S or A. For example, Windows 2000. Where's Windows 2000? Oh, there we go. Windows 2000. It, it is built on NT. And other major operating systems are built on NT2, which we will come back. Now the time for Windows 10. Oh, oh. I am not a, it's not a yay amazing operating system. I need to full, full screen it because it doesn't work with all the full screen. It looks so bad. Oh, oh, start menu. Start menu is icons are pretty flat and the tiles are coming from those like this. Start menu is a copy of Windows 8. Oh, there, there is a notification. Oh, why I can't bring up the notification center? It isn't called notification center, it's called action center, but never mind. Google do the icon can't work because you don't. Know, I really love this background light shooting out from a Windows logo, it is pretty cool. Oh. Oh, they're putting the first Google's ever Google search. Where's where's the cursor? Oh, sorry, sorry. Look, Task Viewer. This is this doesn't work. But if you don't know, it's multitasking. Search Cortana. I I I love to to speak with her, but I'm kind of sad. But she is longer, longer part of the setup. But if you can roll, let's say Windows 10, you can can use it as much as you want. Okay, Microsoft Edge. Oh, Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge work. Oh, it doesn't work. Microsoft Edge has Edge HTML. Normally it has Chromium, but this version has the legacy version. Um. I don't think that, that it is a great operating system if you consider, uh, for example, Windows 7. So I'm going to put Windows 10. I'm not going to put on B because it was reverse. Maybe C. It, C, 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 C. It's, it's obviously C. Now we will test Windows Vista. Oh, people said that launch was terrible. It was the worst operating system of all time. But I don't mind. So I will look at it because I really like this operating system. If you're mad at me, sorry about that. But this operating system was my family operating system. And this was pretty cool. For example, it had fancy graphics with arrow, but I can't use arrow on this. Um, 
Oh, I oh oh I didn't know that. Oh, it has pretty cool. This might be virtual machine thing. Everything is virtual machine thing, but I don't know. I don't know. It's nice. It's nice. Oh, there was a file explorer. I I love looking at file explorers of them because almost every Windows version has a great file explorer. Oh, it's cool. Cool. Never mind. Start menu. Oh, start menu. I love this two button interface. It isn't. People said that it is ugly too, but I think it isn't. Oh, oh. It has documents, picture, music, which is pretty cool if you ask me. You it has sub menus just like the older operating systems. Oh, control panel. That's cool. Still working on it. Oh. I love this operating system. All of the bugs are because of this, 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 this simulator. Oh, never mind. No. Salter. Oh, I love Salter. Oh, Internet Explorer. Me personally, I, I, I miss Salter. Oh, I want Salter. So. Oh, there was a command prompt. This doesn't work. Oh, it crashed. Sometimes it crashes. They designed the simulator to show that it crashed. Oh. Oh, it's, it's good. It's cool. It's a cool operating system, but honestly, I'm, I'm going to put a, 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 just because the launch was terrible, um, can I put on B? No, no, I'm putting it on A tier. Now we are going to Windows 8.1. Oh. Oh, where is Windows 8.1? I couldn't find find this no download simulator for Windows 8.1, and I couldn't find a screenshot for Windows 8.1 too. So I ended up switching to the Windows 8 one just to to look at it. Oh, oh, this is. Well, the start menu is pretty controversial, but honestly, it's it doesn't like for get any likes from most people. But I really hate I hate this operating system. I include it because if we put Windows eight, it would go a G G. F isn't enough for. For this operating system, because the start menu was pretty controversial. Oh, yeah, you can look your mail on the web. I don't care. I don't care. Oh, if you want to know, it has a trans menu, but I don't. It isn't sorry, but it is unnecessary. Oh, I. Hit the metro apps. I can't minimize or close apps. It's not these apps are now called UWP apps or universal Windows platform apps. Oh, Windows 8.1. 8 uh, uh, it has a file explorer. Okay, that's great. But it looks like Windows 10 and earlier brews of Windows. Uh, oh, I will. I will run Windows 11 in a virtual machine because I know how to use a virtual machine. I can't use VMware or VirtualBox for it. So um, I'm gonna put it on F tier. I really don't like it. Now it's time for Windows 11. I will run Windows 11 on a virtual machine 
and I will make it last because it is the most, the best one. Oh, Windows XP. Where's my Windows XP? Windows XP, Windows XP. Oh, here, here, here. Let's close. Close, close, close. Oh, I love, I love this list. I love this background. It has the start menu, but it is also featured on the older modern versions of Windows. Email, Minesweeper. Oh, I said that I love Minesweeper in 98.js. I didn't know that I'm a pretty good on my sweep. Oh, I lost. I lost. Help me. So whatever. My computer. Oh, I always look at explorers because it's cool. I don't know. It's cool. Notepad. Notepad seems like the same. It was pretty cool. I I love this operating system. So I'm gonna put it on SST. -ish. Everyone loved this operating system. It sold very well. And this is my IT class computer. They were very underpowered and couldn't damn those wrist out. Or upper, so we use Windows XP. There are still several people using Windows XP, but the end of support was in 2006, which Windows Vista came out. Oh, in Windows 11, I was pretty good when Windows 11 released. Oh, I need to run it on Task Manager. I won't show it. I'm I will go ahead and run a sandbox in full screen. Oh, let's unpin it here. It is pretty good. It's a pretty good operating system. This is the best operating system of all. All yeah. if you don't count Windows XP and Windows 7. It is so good. It's like a reskin of Windows 10, and people say Windows 11 just sucks, but they, it was probably just their computer. For example, File Explorer was so good it was so cool there isn't any clutter anymore here oh there is no more action center there is now notifications and calendar i can make do not disturb which is pretty cool let's turn on the focus Oh, these are the quick settings. Night lights. You can you can now access to er, night captions won't work with top to light captions. <laughs> it's like a me. Oh, let's look at Microsoft Edge. If we write I explore. Oh, that's pretty cool that it doesn't have Internet Explorer anymore, just the Chromium Microsoft Edge. And if you can see, sites open immediately. That's pretty cool. So never mind. Oh, Windows Explorer. I, I looked at literally every version of Windows Explorer. Oh, Task Viewer. This is, you know, multitasking. This existed in Windows 10 too. Did you, you heard of Windows 10X? Oh. You need to know Windows 10X. Windows 10X had a lot of features that were present in Windows 10 11, 
So they cancelled it and they released Windows 11. Oh, what happened? It just froze. The connection to the sandbox was lost. Okay, because it's clear that we would be short. We should put obviously Windows 11 to the S STO. Wait a minute. And finally, we have MS DOS. I had a lot of trouble finding MS DOS because I didn't find MS DOS. So, oh, oh, I looked at that too. So, going to here. These MS DOS simulators. Oh, this. It had random commands, so it was pretty pretty catastrophic oh what we should write directory on it that was pretty bad for computer beginners ms dos game I need to, oh these are the ms dos games we can use dos box oh you know we use dos box but we can basically assume that it, it would go to Windows to see because like Windows 8.1 I couldn't find find a not downloading simulator for MS DOS. I couldn't find even a downloading simulator, but whatever. Thanks for watching. A like, subscribe or comment is always appreciated. Oh oh 37 minutes and a half. Oh, we created a record. We created a record. Thanks for watching. Watching because normally, virtually, it took 45 minutes to produce this video. See you in the next video.